Will, the other day you had a delivery and this thing called a nine buck mini showed up and I have no experience with this, but tell us a bit what it is. It looks like a mini Segway of sorts. It is indeed. So the company Ninebot, um, Ninebot.ninja, they were kind enough to send us one of these. Now, what this is, is it's a potential base for you. You being the robot we're working on for a university project. Um, do you want to see what's inside? Yes, please. Yes, okay. I've heard great things, but you know, these days it's hard to explain. Okay, so this is kind of going to be like the world's worst unboxing, so <laughs> I'll try to explain what it, what I see and what we see, because yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm obviously not set up with that. So open it up, and first we see a wonderful box for you. Uh, hmm? Nine mini stuff. Charger, all that. I, I, we you can take a look at that uh, in a bit. In a it's bit. just the uh, decorative blade ticks and extended air tap and stuff like that. Get us, uh, get us a good view of the, the real stuff here. <laughs> okay, so more covers. Okay, now this is a bit heavy, so I will need a hand getting it out. So if okay. you hold, there's a wheel there, just pick, pick it up. Good okay, I'll put this aside. This is, uh... And there we have it. Mm -hmm. Now, a confession is, I did open this before. Yeah, I had the hunch because I've seen you uh, sort of uh, whizzing by outside uh, <laughs> earlier today. I kind of fell and did that to my phone. I don't know if you can see oh, that. Oh, yeah. that looks expensive. Oh well. The cost of funny. Eh? So this comes in a nice little. I think it's a hand receipt. I think it's, it's somehow it's kind of twisted itself. Oh. oh, there we are. Ah. Get that out of the way. And so here we have. Ta da! The and base, nice and that's base. it. That's literally it. Can I just feel this? Because it's it's actually pretty happy. It looks kind of, it feels kind of sturdy, but huh? It's it's weird. So all you need to do from? is tap on the power button there, and Ooh. that's it. So I'm just going to spin this. So okay, no, I'm not. So it's supposed that. to be like a handle up from there, or there to go between your legs. There I've seen is a handle, and ah. I think it's in the box. But there we go, if I just open that and get this handle out, no, let's get this handle up. There we go. So, unlike the segways you're used to, where there's the handles, this, this is a 9 bot Mini, and what this does instead is it gyroscopically balances, automatically. <laughs> automatically, love that word. I love that word, yeah. So, if we turn it around, you oh, so see... Essentially using this hair uh, to sort of assist or, or indicate. I mean, Exa exactly. So way? it's kind of like a lever. It's it that's nice. Forward goes forward. Yeah. Back goes back. Left goes left. Right goes right. It's pretty straightforward. Nice. Would you like to have a go? Mm, yeah. Uh, here we go. I've got our lovely assistant Jess here, who who will give us a nice demo outside in a bit. But but just for now, it's gonna be kind of hard to see from the the camera there. But I'm gonna let's take a look. Put me on the spot here, man. Uh, okay, so if you could try, think that you want to move forward. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> so. Instant Pro. Now, what I love about these things is no matter how sort of. It's, it's essentially idiot proof. No matter how bad you are at balance and stuff, it, it automatically balances itself. It's really good. Because, like, how long have you been on there? You're, you're, you're sort of couple drive of time is a couple of seconds. Yeah. Like, you're on there, you're not falling off. It's interesting because I've never sort of done um, you should wheel back anything a bit, like so you this. So you go to the view of the camera. But yeah, carry on. I've tried a unicycle before. Yeah. And getting on a unicycle, Idiot. there's a lot of oscillations and you go like, holy shit. And I could feel that for a second when I sort of got up, but instinctively I pressed you, my, my- uh, Your knees to get support and then you just, Ooh. your brain just adapts. Yeah. And it's so much fun. Now, what I love most about this, um, or why I spoke to Ninebot about this, is um, you can't actually hear anything. It is dead. Silent. Yeah, because the only thing I hear now is the uh, there's, on the floor. There's like a weird linoleum type base. That's the only thing I hear is like the, the wheels rubbing against that. But that's it. So it's an there. excellent way to sneak up on people and say, so, yeah. Because yeah, I, I mean we we talked like uh, a bit about this base before yeah. uh, before it arrived. Because we have, as we mentioned, a project where we kind of want a really silent base. And uh, exactly. So so, so I mean, what we might need to do is a bit of um you know, robots hacking and, and maybe get inside it and see if we can somehow hijack its controls. Now, I'm gonna show you something really cool, um, but I'll need you to step, up for, step off for a bit. 
Uh, okay. That's fine. So I don't know if you can actually see up from the camera. I'll have a look, yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, might just, you might need to do some editing, but let's just get this working for you. Right, so now as you can see, the robot is, or the robot base is over there. Mm -hmm. um, and then watch as it moves by itself. Ooh. Because that's what it is. It is actually a mini robot. I'm probably going to crash it now. But I can summon it with an app, the sort of an app they give you that comes with it, and look at yeah, that. Yeah, because I can see you control it, almost like you know the, the parrot drums that I've seen you crash my And I've just crashed it. But it's got a great app. I mean, I'll probably put a link to it on the description yeah. so you can, um, people can take a look. But yeah, that's it. I think we should go outside and give this thing a proper test. Absolutely. Uh, all for oh. scientific reasons, of course. Let's just get the, uh, the details on our way. Oh yeah, the last bit. Um, yeah, it comes comes with that. It's a power brick of some description. This looks like the Norwegian one. I guess that's, you can get a, a normal three prong. Uh, anyway. Adapter. Yep. Who cares? Uh, and the manual washing shirt. What is that? I think this is for for air? pumping up air. Yeah. If I you see. are to get oh, access, so the tires probably. Actually, yeah. Tires. Fantastic. Pneumatic tires. Pneumatic tires. Ooh. But yeah, that's essentially it. I mean, it's a great little fun device and we're going to have a play. And so see you outside. Indeed. Yeah.